Hey, what's up guys? Reggie's here again. Now currently guys, we're in a place called Chorley. There's a famous slogan around here. Chorley FM, coming in your ears since 19... Whatever it is. Anyway, yeah, that's the radio station of Chorley. Coming in your ears though, I don't know about that one. What about you guys? So yeah, we're just... Uh, gonna get a wander of this place because they've had a, a lot of they've had a lot of work d done around here and uh, we're gonna go and do a bit of exploring now the heavens are ready to open guys and we feel it spitting already so we might have to duck for cover a few times as well so I will crack on guys ciao So guys, Reggie's here again. Just had a nice putty at this spot here in Chorley. So if you're ever down in Chorley, guys, make sure you give it a visit, the hot roast. And uh, it was a cracking butty. So guys, and a crack on with the journey. And thank you for that love. You have love, a lovely love. day. Thank you, Take guys. care, love. Enjoy. Thank you, love. Thank you. See you, love. So yeah, that set me up for the day there. Bit of a, bit of a sandwich. And um, we can go out and check the rest of Charlie. Yeah, yeah, get them to message me so I know who it is. Sorry, love. We're still early in the morning. And um, it's getting quite busy, guys. Yeah, it's getting quite busy. I look at the dog there. So guys, this is the Charlie Council. Can you add them and eat it, guys?
Sorry? Just getting a couple of photos of your notice boards, is that okay? Where are you from? I'm from Preston. Preston? What have you, are you doing it to someone, someone's behalf in here? No, no, no. no. Just uh, seeing how friendly Charlie is and stuff like that in regards to gaining information. Do you have permission to do that? Do you have permission to do that? I don't think you should come and do that. Yeah, it's a public place, isn't it? Sorry? Is it a public place? Well, it's not public. Well, it is, but it's like an office, so you can't just go around taking photos. Well, you can. Can you? Yeah. Well, like I said, I've got I've got them now, so I'm done. You should ask permission for to do it. Can you really? You should just come and take photos. Well, you can do, by law. Right. Well, you should, you should ask. Why are you taking, why are you taking them? What the for? Well, now you're being funny. I'm not telling you. No, I'm not being funny. I'm just asking for questions. Because I would have liked if you, if you came and asked them how to take photos. You know, how to take photos. And... What, am I work? Is that your work? No, but you said, how oh, would I feel? I was at you and I came. Yeah, but I went. You you got up. I didn't even know you were there. So yeah. Um, I, mean, not, I think it's probably polite just to say I'm taking photos. Oh, pol polite's well gone out of the window in this day and age, lovey. No, but just don't come taking photos. Well, you can do. You can't. No, we're not asking permission. No. Who, from who? So you don't I'm even arguing, know. I'm not arguing. You don't even know. I think it's right to protect them. Well, I think people like you are going to infringe on people's rights like myself. It's only a photo. I'm not going to. There. Yeah, because my memory's short. You should ask really and say, can I take photos? What, of the notice board? Yeah, yeah, yeah. You're crazy, lovey. Oh, well, whatever then. See ya. Bye. <laughs> Free information, so what's your problem? Anyway, guys. Me done. Surely FM. No, actually, no. Let's take a few shots from the outside. Just what was the problem, really? I really don't understand. Yeah, I really just don't understand what their problem is. Hey, what's up guys? Reg is here again. So I've just been making my way back from Chorley and uh, I noticed that a crane has turned up here at the canal side next to Botany Bay and we have got a barge on a flatbed so I thought it might be of interest to try and get this on film really so the crane's down there have you ever seen what they look like underneath look at that there guys Put all barnacles on. Looks like one's already gone in, look. One's already going in. Yeah, so we got the R500 Scania with a splitter flatbed, look. That in the middle there extends it. So that will be longer than most road trailers. So yeah, there's a barge waiting to go in the water. All right, buddy. How are you, sir? So yeah, we're just wandering down now. I've got my tour guide with me today. Uh, and 
<laughs> no, he's uh, he's gone elsewhere, guys. I was hoping they were going to come on the journey with me. So there is a crane now. Dropping one of the barges in. And we got a Richard Lester transport over there. He's probably just a bit had that on back of him. Must be light enough for the yard crane. But that John Skeets just turned up there. Mobile crane, and he's gonna do the lifting of The one that's on that flatbed. Now it's called the Cliver O2, guys. Look at that. Hi, buddy. How are you? So yeah, we got Botany Bay down there, guys. So look, we're on the move here now, guys. So I'll get alongside uh, canal for that, I think. Hi, right, buddy. Hold on. Short East Shore, mate. Is it? Yeah, sure. Is he all right? I just wanted to get a bit of a foot, bit of footage of him lifting it off, you know. Wonder what they're doing at Botany Bay. Pardon? Wonder what they're doing at Botany Bay down there. Building units. Are they? Not very long. Oh well. And what what is that road there? Is that the road that takes you to Botany Bay? No, that's the original road. Was it? Right. Ah. What a, sh what a shame that is, eh? It's just, uh, business, uh, I think. It's just what, mate? It just has an accounts business in that, like silver building and Did they? that's it. Oh, brilliant. It's is it? Is it? Serious? <laughs> What, the guy who owns Botany Bay? Com comes to work in a helicopter? Serious? No. No. Hey, have you met um, John and Susan? John and Susan there. We're going for a stroll down the canal. No. 
It's not mine. John and Sue's in there. We'll walk a bit further down to Botany Bay as well and see what footage we can get there, guys. And we'll come back to this, uh, the lifting off of this barge because I don't think it'll be for a while yet. I think they'll probably have to get that other one out of the way there, the one with slings on. So, ciao. So I overheard this come all the way from Newark, guys. One of them barges has made its way into the middle of the canal. So the driver of the crane said it's a baby. It looks heavier than what it is, basically. I've got a funny feeling the Arctic driver is going to pull out, right? And he's going to just drop it on the floor for the crane behind it to just lift it up and drop it in canal. Could be wrong, guys. I suppose while he's got hold of it, he might as well spin it around and drop it in canal. Makes sense, doesn't it? So we've got Eric over there just walking around the back of the trailer. He used to be an absolute brawler back in his day. They reckon he could take out five or six fellas, no problem. And all he'd need is a crate of Stellas. Oh yeah, absolute animal. He used to be into that wachow kind of business, you know. But anyway, there you see, we've got all of the crane, look at that. Got all of the barge, come on. Look at that there, guys. So the Arctic's pulling out. Oh, he's going to drop it in canal. Good lad. Look at that there, guys. Look at that there. Brilliant, isn't it? Over there. Look at that there, guys. Not often you see that, is it? Big lad, oh he's gonna hit the crane. No way. Nearly. 
Bodge and Elliot the Crown, then guys. Crazy, isn't it? Jobs are good, and guys. Anyway, what does that do over there? That or is it? Take care, guys. Look at that there. <laughs> Got an oil leak. So anyway, yeah, we're not going to watch him untangle his chains. It's in the water, isn't it? That's good enough for me. So until next time, I'm going to say, ciao, guys. Now look at this actually, someone wants to come past with uh, their own barge in a minute. They are, they're coming past. Let's get these on, let's get these on camera. Let's see if we can get a wave off these on barge. How's he going to navigate past that barge there? So they'll need to sort that out, won't they, soon? That'll be a tree in no time, that. Oh, it's only a baby, isn't it? The Murrays. Hello. How much is it tired out for a day? That's not bad, is it? Ah, brilliant. Boats to hire.uk, co.uk. That's good, that. You can have a good grand day out of it, I bet, can't you? Blimey. Have a nice day, lovey. And how far have you been on it? Oh, Adlington. Oh. oh. Okay, thank you. See you, lovey. Hey, I tell you what, guys, I've never thought about that, you know. Um, mm, I think I might hire a barge, you know. I'm sure this is a uh, thingy. Let's 
this is a uh... oh, he's on the phone I was going to try and get his attention anyway but yeah so um, as I was saying that lady said about £100 to hire for the day what a good crack that would be So I am going to say till next time, ciao guys.